<laughs> now to Orlando, where a conference for women and non-binary people in computing, in technology. Basically, this is meant to be women's only event. Well, take a look at the footage that some of the attendees posted on social media complaining. I mean, they'd forked out $1,300 to be there. What I'm looking at seems like a lot of guys to me. I don't know about you, but there seems to be a lot of men there indeed. So these women complained, saying they were being shoved out of the way by men. It was attended by all these prospective employers so that these women could do a meet and greet and get a foot in the door, etc., and so on. Instead, because it wasn't just women's but women and non-binary people, a whole heap of blokes just went, well, I want in, wrote down non-binary on their application forms and sailed right on in. And in today's culture, you couldn't question it. No. Well, exactly. That's what I want Today to know. Today, I'm non-binary. How did they know there are a whole bunch of men invading their non-binary thing? They ought not be assuming anybody's gender at That's their right. function. And I want to know, when they go to all these tech conferences, do they program in non-binary code? <laughs> <laughs> that, that was a good one. That was very good.